Hey guys, happy Friday. So, you guys thought you got away with our squatting for this week. You didn't. Today, we got squats every three minutes for nine minutes. Our goal is to build to a heavy five. All right, so we'll take some time in a warm up, really loading that barbell, and then every three minutes for nine minutes, um, we want each of these three reps to be challenging and building. All right, and so the back squat is per usual. Uh, we get the barbell set on our back. These are obviously come from the rack, but when a barbell gets set on your back, you gotta just go ahead and organize your feet, shoulder width apart, toes pointing slightly out. You really wanna kinda create some tension by bringing the barbell down into this part. And so we wanna take a big belly breath. And we wanna go five of those. Again, chest tall. Driving the knees out, east and west, as we sink our hips down, hit the bottom, stand up, squeezing our legs together, all right? So again, every three minutes for nine minutes, we have five reps. We wanna start heavy, and then we wanna end heavy. So we wanna build through the three opportunities. Guys, get strong, go for it, go get it. So for today's conditioning, guys, it'll be more on the easier skill based side so we'll have a 15 minute imam uh, the first minute will be responsible for 12 calories on the assault bike 12 calories if you're a guy 10 calories if you're a lady all right once you guys get done with those 12 or 10 you rest the remainder of that minute the next minute we just want to do 10 handstand push-ups or any variation you guys have whether it's the pike push-up whether it's the elevated push-up um, elevated handstand push-up or whether it's just normal push-ups however you guys want to do that. Even if you want to stack ab mass today, I'm completely chill with that. We just want to operate what we can do 10 in a row. All right, so we want to kip with these. And if 10 is very, very easy or readily available to you guys, go ahead and try to create a deficit for yourself. All right, so then we'll go 10 handstand pushups. The handstand pushup starts with straight arms and end with straight arms. Um, I've seen people like just start on their head and kick up and then they count that as one pushup. That's simply not. All right, it starts with extended arms and it ends with extended arms. So we got to flip up into this handstand. We come down. We come up. We come down. We come up. All right, and so um, that was just kind of a strict version because I don't have a mat, I have a hat on. Um, and I want to protect myself. You guys can use any variation that's available to you for 10 of those. And then that'll complete your second minute. And then in the third minute, you guys will go 15 male ball sit-ups. You guys wanna use a 20 pound uh, wall ball if you're a guy, 14 pounds if you're a lady. We wanna have our feet together. The ball starts behind the head. The ball ends in front of the foot. It starts behind the head, front of the foot. And that happens every time. The ball touches the ground behind our head and the ball touches the front of our foot with every repetition, all right? So we wanna go 15 of those, and then we'll rest the remainder of that minute. And we don't have a minute rest um, in this EMOM, and so you guys have to make your way right back to the bike uh, and kinda get after it again. So it's 15 minutes of pretty much continuous movements through those three movements. 12 calories on the bike if you're a guy, 10 if you're a lady, 10 handstand push-ups, and then 15 med ball sit-ups. Guys, have fun with this one. Go get it.